I'm looking forward to like when you look at this stuff. Some like heavy armors, machine guns, stuff like that. Okay, okay, so. I wish the music was playing when I go to the menu. We got a lot of side missions. I think we can keep pushing the main mission. The, the side missions are just gonna be on the way. Oh yeah, I completely forgot. Wait, oh, kill. Oh, it doesn't. Oh, there we go. That's strange. I was clicking the button, it wasn't showing the the puff where to go. Okay, new area. Gemini stacks. Gemini. Insta takes out weapon. That kinda shows there's gonna be no friendlies around, I bet. Let me remember how to play again. Oh shit. Oh yeah, I wanted to... I wanted to bite the grenade. Oh shit, they have katanas now. Yeah, those are different guys. We are in a different town, part of the town. Oh yeah, we have the power-ups, I forgot. Oh shit, the small guys, man. Couldn't even see them. See, the camera in this game is sometimes a problem, for sure. Like the angles. People shoot you, even that you can't see them. A launcher? Okay. That's something new. Oh, that's mines. Wait, no. Is there an enemy? There is a guy shooting rockets. Oh, this! Oh... I see, they put down like... Fireworks kind of thing on the ground, like a launcher. I see, I see. Did we get anything new? I get like a launcher or something. Dominator. Machine gun? Rocket launcher? Okay. RPG? Interesting, okay, okay. It has better DPS than the... The Dread. 11.19. Uh, let's see the stats. Rounds per second. Per second is kinda... Uh, it's, it's worse, apparently. Better clip size. 100 knockback. I mean, we can try it out. I spend a lot of points in dread. Let's see both of those weapons. That's interesting. I mean, 
How much damage per rocket it does? I have a skill point too. Let's just go... Weapon reloading, I guess. One forty-eight, two, two, two. I mean, like sh slow shooting weapons are not that great. I can probably shoot the laser pistol many times in the same time. Four hundred knockback, though. We can try them out for sure. We can just try that, try out those weapons. Okay, the... Definitely the problem is... The spread. The spread is a problem. You can see how crazy... The spread is when you shoot, and if you compare it to the dread... Yeah, the dread is so accurate, man. The dread is so accurate. That's why I like it so much. Because, you know, my aim is not that bad. And... I'd rather hit more shots with less damage. But we, we can try out new weapons for sure. Let's, get, let's do it. Let's see. I'm going the wrong way. It's above us apparently. Time to test new weapons, but let's do it. You can't have it. Just oh shit, they have like cloaks on them. Onyx Void Operative. Shit, okay. Okay, the rockets. Oh, dang, son. No, man, okay. Okay, the rockets. Damage, really good. Groups of people. But that moment, definitely the rocket didn't help there. Let's keep trying the machine gun, though. I really like the Dread Assault Rifle, but... What the hell? I was stuck going backwards. Oh, I keep forgetting. I have to remember to use my power-ups again. I really like that you just don't have to reload for so long when you... I just don't have enough rolls. I'm gonna die again. Yeah. I don't know, man. I don't know. Like, you're, you're just like slow. Hmm. I'm, I'm gonna, I think, switch to the previous weapons. Let's see, that's a good test actually right now when I just use my old school weapons. I think now we're gonna shred them. A laser pistol, pistol especially. Which is so good. I don't think the new weapons will work. For us here. Like, look at this guy melting away.
I hate how I can't see them. Yeah, the camera angles are kind of weird in this game. That's one thing. When people can't see you, but you can't see them. Oh, there was multiple named guys. See the laser pistol damage? Crazy. Absolutely crazy. Oh yeah, we have a bounty from the other guy now. Cool. See, I don't know about the machine gun. Rocket launcher I can see vi being viable. Group, Big groups of enemies. It just... I mean, the laser pistol, crazy damage. Just nothing can catch up to it, even when I'm upgrading those weapons fully. When we, when we look at the... Man, the, the rifle is so accurate. And you can move quite fast when it comes to... Machine gun. Oh, similar speed, but look at the spread. You can just keep shooting and shooting, but I mean... The accuracy. Accuracy is king. Kinda sucks, I wish I could use different weapons, but I'm just... I guess I'm a meta slave. Those are just too good. Dread and Pacifier or whatever it's called. Are we good or are we just leaving this place? Yeah. I'm looking forward to like different laser weapons. I hope there is more laser weapons in the game, I guess. If the pistol is that good. It's kind of like the old school Fallout. Once you get the plasma weapons, you don't go back. I don't like how they, when they enter the area, jumping down from those bikes or something, that you can't hit them. They have iframes. That's lame. Ow, 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 I'm dead. Oh my god, close. I can never tell if my my shit is up or not. We've got new items, but again, I think the stats are never changing. The only the legs are new. And they are Well. Ballistics is bad. More health and in general, like better defensive stats overall. I kind of think it's worth Joyrunner. Yeah, it seems worth. Like the the health. I don't think that's actually health. Oh yeah, that's not health. That's just the. Oh yeah, that's the different stats under, under health. Those are the boosts. No attributes. I mean. Yeah, vital science is health, and it affects biometrics, so this is biometrics. It's 
still good, I guess. I think I'm, I think I'm gonna go for it because it just has so many different protections. Like, I bet soon we're not gonna just have people with regular guns. It's gonna be more... Oh yeah, bounty. It's gonna be more about the different elements. Another one bites the dust. Some you creds for you. I might buy the new grenade. We have so much money. You return, and I see you brought the tag. I did not expect you to live. This is mildly impressive. The Malhorse Gel Corporation has your indents. The carrier they're holding them on is scheduled for departure in a few cycles. Check the Cosmodrome. Since MG Corp are in breach, they are no longer enjoying our protection. Okay. I think we have to wait for a call now. Northwest, okay, okay. Want to get jazzed? The looting robot, I mean... Only places where you have to use it to get like a piece of gear hidden somewhere. Outside of that, this is really not worth using, I think. Hyperfocus is great. I don't know if I should buy the lock on fire. I mean... 26k. There's really nothing to buy though. Unless the, the vendors will, will soon get new stuff. I just don't like the idea about the lock on fire. Might as well shoot myself. I think I'm just gonna buy the grenade, that's for sure. It's expensive, but it kinda sounds cool. Like a void grenade. Is it here? It is. You're not just any wiry. The sweet justice. Causes a sudden gravity fold, which will crush anything within range. The drone? Huh. Like, this is the most expensive one, the sweet justice one. Fuck it. I mean, that's a lot of money. Oh, we have two shocks? Fuck it. Stasis and overcharge. Put enemies into stasis state by using certain augmentation abilities or tactical gear. Once in stasis, they take additional damage that uh, that will all come at once when it, the effect is over. If you manage to accumulate enough damage, the target will overcharge and explode, causing massive damage. Oh shit, okay. That's why it's so good. And I think that's actually gonna... I think that's actually gonna be the part of the side quest I had, and I didn't know how to how to do it. Um, tactical sweet justice. Okay, that's an ominous laugh. I guess I'm gonna keep the other ones for now. No need to sell that stuff. And we're gonna test it out, yeah, because there was a quest. There was like this doctor that told me to... Is it actually that? Or am I thinking about different effect? Uh, da, 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 da. 
Yeah, we have a, a bunch of side missions around here too. One more camera for this guy. Prison break. Overcharge kills. Using Stasis Overcharge, yeah. That's exactly it. So, this guy wanted me to kill 10 people using that, so now it's gonna happen. Go to Scrapland. Or the Carolans. Oh yeah, I couldn't go up there. I could not go up there before. I still don't think we can go up there. There is a kind of br like a broken elevator and I have a bunch of quests there. Maybe I just have to follow the main one. Right here, there is like a mechanical, mechanic shop, hardware. Yeah, I can't talk to anyone and they have a broken elevator. That makes me think like... Yeah, it clearly shows this. I'm right here. So I'm pretty sure we just have to do something, follow like the main mission, or whatever. Go to Cosmodrome, yeah this is level 6, like we are, we just have to follow the main missions. Let's follow the main missions. Looking forward to testing that grenade. It better be worth all the money I spend on it. I mean, we're gonna finish that side quest anyway, but I want the grenade to be good. So far the other grenades I had were pretty shitty, so... Oh, we just have to leave this way. Is the, is the side mission to go to the jail? Also down there. Where are we even going? I don't see a marker showing me where to go. Race truck. Yeah, like, am I blind? Is it just somewhere? No, they are just not showing me where to go for the quest. Is it bugged? I just yeah. It's just it's just like bugged or something. They're just not showing me markers for quests. It just bugged out completely. Huh.
So at this point, I, I don't know if I should be fast traveling or not. That's kind of annoying. When I don't know where the marker leads me. I'll just keep running though. go down there we have a bunch of guys oh there's clearly a weapon here we have a grenade ready too oh i can't go in there oh that sucks it's on the other side Like this combo, the rifle and the laser pistol is just too good. That was kind of cool looking but underwhelming when it comes to damage. I guess those guys are pretty tanky, yeah. Those were wrong enemies to use the nade on. Oh, maybe they have like protection for... I mean, the pistol always does a lot of damage, but maybe they do have ballistic protection. It does like a ding sound. Bouncing of their armors. Oh, thanks for the cinematic camera view when I'm fighting people. Yeah, the camera is an issue in this game. Quite often. Some of them exploded with that Stasi stuff, I think. I don't even know where I'm going, to be honest. I'm gonna end up running into high-level mobs, probably. Yeah, laser pistol is just irreplaceable. Too good. Oh, is this a shortcut? Level up. Oh. This might be a shortcut. Cyber deck upgrade. Ice pick. I think like I picked up a lot of the cyber deck upgrades and we just can't use them. I think I just have to progress with the main story. Okay, apparently I just can't go through here. That sucks. What the... Oh, that's the prisoners, I think, place. Oh, that's the quest with the prisoners, then. Because they... Ow. There we go. They stole a mech. Yeah, siege mech. Okay, I think. Defense component? Oh, shit. Okay. It looks like the... Higher upgrades for the weapons is gonna be different materials. Wait, so because this is not the main quest, let me mark the the prison quest. Oh, now they show. Hell yeah, I'm here. The glut. Meat face basement? Prison break. Return to Alex. Oh yeah, we did it. That was the mech. That was where the prisoners went. Okay, dead end. Let's go with this way though.
Fancy chests. Cannot open this. The hell? I just opened the chest twice? There's two chests in, in each other. Okay. What did we even get from all of this? Nothing new. Literally nothing new. I guess I, I got the cyber deck upgrades. We just can't really do anything about it. I mean, it, it is cool when they change the camera for you. For the cinematic part, but... When they do it when there is enemies around... That's really not working well. Can we open those? Yeah, those are lockers. Nice, money. Yeah, like right here, if there's enemies under you, you just can't see them attacking you. Back to this guy. Definitely hope that the bug with the map is not gonna be happening more often because I can just fast travel whatever something is far. Oh, so many of those shirt skins, I think they repeat. To get the duplicates. Because I just keep getting more, but I had like three skins last time I checked. See what are you gonna give me? Amazing, you ended the breakout. Let's just say the boom is gonna be big and loud. Maybe now I can work on taking my ass out of here. I mean, I'm getting too old for this shit anyway. Here, take this. I don't have any need for it anymore. Okay. Oh, there we go. Four and a half K. Razor Dronets. I mean, I, I like that the side missions give you, like, unique stuff. But, oh! Razor Dronettes. Initiate a swarm of drones that deal damage to enemies in range. Oh, shit, that's, that sounds really cool. Good thing I didn't buy the other thing then. Another premium 8-co product. These micro-drones are pre-programmed to find target weak spots and maximize damage output. Okay. I mean... Hell yeah, that sounds about us. So before we go, let me see. Hopefully the... Or maybe when you... Maybe when you are here, yeah. It does look like when you are here, maybe it bugs out. Let's go down. Last time when I was checking the, the objectives in this place, they wouldn't show them up either. We do have, like, the beginning of the game side missions to turn in in the first town. I can just fast travel there. There's definitely more side missions around here, though. Go back. Go to Scrapland. Like, this is here. Humidity Doctor. Lost and Found is here. Overcharge kills. Okay, I have 0 out of 10 still. Midface basement. It's right here. Well, let's see. Can we? Okay, it's leading me somewhere. Hell yeah, I'm down to do side missions in this game. The world is cool enough to spend more time in. 
I don't know how long the game is in general, but there's no rush. Oh wait, I replaced the wrong thing. What the hell? How did I not replace the drone? Or the like? Oh god. Oh man. I think maybe they have to explode and kill enemies around them. Maybe that's what the objective is from the doctor. Yeah, I replaced the wrong fucking thing, man. How did that happen? Like the loot and the thing, I was... I was gonna replace this. That's under Q. Hyperfocus, Razor Drones. There we go. I don't know how I feel about the Razor Drones, though. I guess they're good for melee guys. It's literally like an aura next to you. Oh, I don't have energy now. Yeah, they definitely are the same skins over and over. Damn, the rifle damage kinda sucks balls now. They have all day in level 12. They have weapons that auto aim into me. They just like follow me. Their bullets. Okay, sorry guy, you literally run into the explosion. The shield so far is the best one. Like, let me see. Okay, when they get close, they get hit. With a lot of damage, that's for sure. Uh, nice cover behind the the vehicle that I can blow up. Okay, the cooldown on this is oh, the cooldown on this is very short. But I guess my drones just disappeared right now, for some reason. From the explosion, I guess? Weird. I guess the explosion blew up my drones. Let's group them up. I want to use the... I'm not gonna group up. Oh shit. I'm just dying. See, like, I don't like that I can't see what's happening when the guys are at the wrong angle. Also, this is a pretty annoying thing. See, I can't even go up here. I'm trying to go up. There's a lot of invisible things in this game. Anything new? Not really. The gear I, I get is just like... It doesn't even... I would understand if the gear looked the same, but the numbers would be different. But they're exactly the same items over and over. But like I said, we're just gonna keep going for the main mission. And hope we unlock more stuff. 
I just keep keep doing too many side missions, I guess. I don't think we even. Oh shit! Level 17s. They didn't even give me an option to upgrade my hacking device yet. Okay, those guys are... Yeah, those guys are high level. They heal each other too, I think. But the weird thing is... Oh, never mind. Level 23. Okay. I take it back. Because some quests in the beginning of the game, they were like, oh yeah, you need level 3 to do this mission. I'm like level 10. And I go there and there's like people with skulls. I can't even see their level. But this makes sense. 23, 22. Race truck. Um, no idea where that one is. Oh, the morgue. We can't go even to the morgue level 10. I think we just have to go with the main mission. Yeah. Cosmodrome. That's right there. I don't even... Like, no. Where I should be going to reach this. Cosmodrome. I kind of want to fast travel, but... 1.6. It just doesn't show me. I guess I can fast travel here. Give me a second though. I'm gonna use the restroom. I think we're gonna fast travel here though. I mean, it's 1.6 kilometer. Okay, it shows there, so... I guess that's fast travel there. Where is it? The node? I wish, I wish they would give you a different price, depending on how close you are. It's always 1k. <laughs> okay, that was... Yikes. What a great value from 1k spent here. Literally the same. Distance. Shield guys. 
drone is nice. The laser pistol is just too good. It's too good. And the rifle is, the dread rifle, is so accurate, long range. That's bike sword? That sounds new. I don't remember gear like this. The boss just getting deleted by the laser pistol. It is, it is OP like this, the pistol though, because I'm playing on PC and I can just spam left click very fast. I'm really good at spamming left click in, in shooters. I remember when I was playing Apex Legends, people would like ask me if I have a macro <laughs> or like how to full auto shoot the hemlock gun because I was just spamming so fast. Oh, that, oh shit, that's how it works. Okay, that should be 1 out of 10. They actually blow up like this. I just never did it before. Because you have to aim higher. And deal enough damage before they fall down. Gotcha, gotcha. Now, th now that should count towards the quest. It should definitely count towards the doctor quest. Yeah, one out of ten. There we go. Nice. Now it counts. Is this literally gonna be- oh, we can sell the bounty. Is this the beginning of the level? I could have fast traveled here. If the game only made it easier. Yep, it literally is. Okay, let's sell stuff to this guy, actually. We have a lot. Sell. See, like, the numbers just don't change, but maybe, like I said, maybe we just have to progress with the game. You just keep getting the same gear. That has nice protection for fire. 45. I mean, in general, the protection on this just really nice, but I mean... 
I really like the stats on this. Probably should wear that. The bike, sir. Let's not sell it yet. the shotgun I guess I'm gonna keep one machine gun launcher for now why not load out okay frame frame cybernetics so we do want to go frame. At least for now. So it is good for us. We lose the boost to the recoil though. That kind of sucks. But the stats are really good on this. Ballistic is definitely something we should go for right now. And this fire protection on this is crazy good. It looks pretty sick too. Those are like cybernetic legs. Let's go for that, that for now. Yeah, that looks pretty badass. He should run faster with something like this. He should just straight up run faster with cybernetic legs. I like those police. Or security mix. Pretty cool looking. Did I level up recently? Actually, I could have upgraded my weapons when I was there. I did. Hmm. So the frame is kind of what we want, but I mean, I, I could go more evasion actually, like the roll. I don't really care about balance, but the being able to roll more often is actually really good. Like really, really good. Let's go one aiming. Those guys are so fucking tanky right now. works. Yeah, those guys have a lot of HP. When I use the, the shield on me, 
I need to just slow walk and aim. So we hit more shots with the pistol. Those two guys were stuck in each other. I like that grenade. The other grenades were shit. This one is actually useful. And there's gonna be like a group of enemies. One blows up. Oh, got stuck. That can do a lot of damage. Investigate. Oh, that's all. Oh, we're here for the luggage too. Like we have a main mission here but also the side one too lost and found there we go in that room oh here too i forgot he is it a part of the quest telling you this he said the color Yellow Yoplas bug. Nug lover. Yellow. So this was yellow, but it's not it. I'm assuming it's gonna be the next room, but. Yeah, there's a lot of yellow bugs. They did it on purpose. Man, you can see they're getting stuck in a game like this is really bad. It happens very often. How can I even, like, the angle here? It's so awkward. How can you aim at them? So like I just have to assume if they're more up or down. Like, this game is not a side-scroller, but they keep changing cameras for the views and stuff. And it's cool, but when there's... There should be no fighting in those areas. Where they change camera like that. Like, the, the guy is running at me and I... Can't hit him. There we go, now we're back. Nice clicked, but okay. bounty this bug has to look like a unique thing I don't see the sticker anywhere there's just yellow bugs I miss the little robot guy when it comes to 
big fights like this, there's just a bunch of loot. But he was pretty shitty at looting too, so... <laughs> Those guys are just sitting there chilling. There we go. Rafael's bug. Did it have a sticker on it? It didn't. Well, like I said. It's just one of the yellow bugs. Main mission. I wonder if the camera for the guy we can plant here too. Attention. Transport 742B is undergoing a rapid refueling for a high priority departure request. One thing for sure, no matter how much money you have starting, starting out, you ain't gonna have nothing by the time you get here. Even the rich got knocked back to zero when they fly out this way. Star flights just soon so fucking expensive and the not so rich yeah good luck with that you'll be a slave for the next thousand cycles paying off the transit and we're just getting so many drops but it's all loot i already had before I wonder if at the end of the game they tell you how many civilians are killed. That would be pretty funny. Chain reaction there. Okay, I feel like the the, the armor or the, the the dome I create definitely lasts longer now. Thanks to my stats. There's just loot everywhere, but me going there. I also don't have any quests right there. It's like, definitely in this game. Like, even that you want to go everywhere and loot, and not miss out on loot, but... It's just kind of like open world, so... I'm just gonna run out into high-level enemies and you probably have to go there eventually for a different quest. What about the camera? Or does he want us to install the camera? It doesn't show. Umbilical. Just keep going then. That grenade is really good. For once we have a good grenade. I think I already killed 10 people with it. Oh, sorry. Oh shit, we already dealt with one of those. This might be our like a boss one though.
Yeah, we already. Oh shit, I'm stuck. Oh god. We already faced a siege mech. Jail quest. Music is so good in this game, though. <laughs> the mech is dying. There we go. And barely got to listen to that. Badass music. Those engineers, they just put all that shit everywhere. Almost missed that one. Oh, that's a gun. Automatic rocket launcher. Okay. Damn, okay, okay. Rejuve field. Non-lethal gadget heals everyone within, within range, including enemies. Oh, that sucks. I mean... Oh, it's a... it's a nade. Definitely not changing my grenade. Oh, so it starts shooting faster and faster. It's kind of cool. Okay, long reload, but I mean... We might try it out. Seems cool. Careful not to blow myself up with this. I just wish they wouldn't drop the same skins over and over, and you like don't have to go back and loot something, and then you find out it's the same shit you already have. Entering? Locate missing scientists. Oh yeah. We just can't. Oh shit. I mean... Oh my god, man, you are so slow with this shit. This kinda doesn't work. about this gun man like oh yeah I like the idea of this gun I mean I definitely close range here it's not gonna work out for us that's for sure Security. Done. Initiating. Icebreaker. Access complete. 
Self unlocked. This is Poof. I see you found our lost habers. Well done. I hope you made those Melhors go. Hold if I can kill them. Onyx Void shares some of the blame, but I want to live to be old and fat, so let's not take them on just now. I tried reaching out to the MG Minion for an explanation, but he's locked himself onto the bridge of that transport and won't answer my pings. Go grab him for me, will ya? Poon out. Oh, is it open now? Analyzing. Lock mechanism set to boarding defense mode. Hatch cannot be opened from outside. Suggestion. Find other means to breach hatch. <laughs> Those explosions are really cool. I just hope you're not gonna play the entire game using one pistol. I just don't see the value in most of the other weapons. Can I pick it up? There we go. Oh, that's a health part. A life support control. Oh, nice. We're just gonna. Report. Contaminated gases vented into bridge compartment. Toxicity levels rising. <laughs> what the hell? Are you trying to kill me? <laughs> what? Whoa, what's the soup? Hey! Let go of me! I'll pay you. Do you know who I am? Couldn't care less. Oh, that's weird. That's like the first time ever we got a, a loading screen. just accepted my call, we wouldn't have had to drag your ass all the way here. <coughs> Go fuck yourself. <coughs> Come now. What was Melhurst Gell planning to do with those indents? I don't have anything to say to you. Talk to my superiors. <coughs> oh, I'm sorry. You seem to have misunderstood your situation. You see, you're officially listed as deceased in a refueling accident at the docks. I can keep you here till you talk, or flatline from exposure. Whatever you prefer. Leave him here. I'll update you later. Cool. This item right there. Still can't reach it, I think. Oh. Close due to bankruptcy. Debtors fuck off. See? This stuff changes. Hmm. Okay, so stuff does change. So maybe the shop, shop will open again and then we can get the item? Because before there was a guy there. Oh, we have even more side missions now. Oh no, that's that's the ones we can turn in. Nice. Hell yeah. Hi man, most impressive. Looks like you really took those people apart. Um, I mean, it looks like you really did your duty for science. I can't tell you, my boy, how thrilled I am with these results. Really, a truly, and truly. Uh, I dare say we have enough here to put the uh, fillers out. See which corpse wanna play ball with us. Okay. What did he give me? Oh, please, me. Stasis Stomp. Oh, I'll level up too. Stasis Stomp. The Razor Dronettes are okay. It's all frame. Launches nearby enemies into the air and puts them in Stasis. Ooh. That's good. I kinda like that more than the drones. We just have to see the range. Cooldown 4? What? Really? So you can just keep spamming this. If you have energy, of course. Oh, that's great. 
Stomp, Hyper Focus, there we go. I need another module. We only have one. One slot is open. Skills. So let's... I mean, the frame definitely benefits our power-ups so far the most. But I... Not big a big fan of balance. Probably it's not smart to leave it behind. There's gonna be stuff in the game that's gonna be slowing me down and shit, but... We can keep putting points in evasion for sure. Faster rolling is definitely nice. Let's put one point in health. And... Hmm. Maybe let's go a little more weapon handling. Definitely there is a lot of weapons that could benefit from faster reload. If I'm gonna be having uh, using like a machine gun or something later on, probably it's gonna be big. Right now, I just don't invest in that because with the pistol, I can just spam it crazy fast. Okay, we definitely have the other side mission here to finish. Let's go there. We can check the stores if they are updated. What we can buy. I think this bar is gonna open. So far it's locked. Oh damn, it does below us. We need an elevator. Oh, is there one here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pretty sure. There we go. Nice. Yeah, definitely I have to keep going with main missions. And there's gonna be a lot, of, a lot of stuff unlocking. Like, that's why I can't upgrade the eyes. Yeah. We got multiple hacks or something. That dropped, but I just can't do anything more with hacking yet. You got the goods? Amazing, we're in business now. Wait a sec, you didn't sample the merchandise, did you? Let's just have a look here and make sure everything's in order. Right then, all here. You did good, little one. We're gonna be blowing it up here in no time. We're gonna get these noobs ripped to shreds in a three weeks flat. You did well, little one. Here, have this. It's It will unleash the beast. Hopefully that's an augmentation. Mission reward, mission reward. Oh. oh, he has another quest. Wait, we just got XP, nothing else? Bro, you again, just the guy I was looking for. So the stuff you got me from our good friend out in the node. Shit is fun fucking tastic. And all but there is the thing. The puny little carlans that's been coming in here. The ones all desperate to get pumped up and that right right quick. Well, I think their hearts have been starting to explode or some shit. Like seriously, the stuff is too intense. They just can't handle it. So yeah, we need some lower grade stuff. Something that Carolans can handle as well. I mean, business, business is booming now. But why leave money on the table? I want to be able to service all my clients. Know what I mean? So be a bro and do one more run for me. Get the newer, lighter grade roids. Except, perfect. I know you'd be a sport. Here's the thing, thing though. Shit's been tight lately, and my guys got had to move from Node to S Steam Town. Uh, thought it would be best to lay low next little bit. These days, no one gets in or in or out of uh, the place without a proper say. So, our boy, well. He figured that would be be a good bet, good place to ride out the shit. So yeah, bro. Assuming you can find a way on in there, get uh, go get my stuff from our boy, and let's and let's you and me get these little guys all jacked up in no time flat. Hard attack not not included that this time out. Okay, one more rep. <laughs> Did he really? Wow, he really. 
just gave me XP. I mean, XP is cool and all, but... Huh. It really didn't give me any... Anything else than that. Huh. Okay, give me a second. I'm gonna be back. In a bit, I just have to do something and I'm gonna pick this out too. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba.
Come back. <clears throat> let's go, let's go. This guy gave us another side mission. Oh yeah, this one is the locked one. I'm assuming more main missions will give me the, the hacking upgrades. So I can access all those chests and new areas. Uh, we can check out quickly the vendors too. Maybe they did. Get more stuff. What is the hammer? Oh, the, the, the guy that upgrades weapons? Mark we probably can't even access yet. Oh, there is... Okay, there we go. New stuff. He has a frag... Fragmore grenade. Leaves a fire behind. Interesting. No, oh, but the Sweet Justice one is pretty, pretty good. If you hit them and the explosion just follows. It's actually really nice. Uh, sell those. We need more money if they have new gear. Yeah, so main missions unlock more gear. Makes sense. Hmm, I guess... I mean, that's good money. Those plants are not that bad. So much fire protection though. Crazy good. I was gonna sell them. Probably we're gonna loot more. And the chests. Weapons. I'm gonna sell the hand cannons. I don't use them. Machine gun. Oh damn, so many. Launcher. Good money for this. I mean... Oh, the rocket launcher has much better damage than the automatic rocket launcher. Probably the automatic one. I mean, see, like, this is crazy because it says it's single fire, not automatic on the pistol. And it's true, but I just spam it so fast. Nothing compares to the pistol in this game. We don't need money yet, so I'm gonna just... Not sell all my good weapons. I'm rating. Really? They give me tutorials now? Okay. Weird tutorial. But I guess like I said, I just didn't do too many main missions, so... What? He doesn't sell anything, yeah. <laughs> The tutorial was pretty random then. It doesn't even sell anything. That I didn't see before. But check the gun shop though. That seems bugged. I mean I should not be getting the... Those tutorials now. Oh, machine guns. Room sweeper. Ballistic submachine gun. Really low damage though. Damn, like a really, really low damage. Shoots way faster. A 60 size clip. And pretty good knockback. Huh. I mean, I just don't want to spend too much money on unknown weapons when they probably will drop from enemies. That seems interesting though. I wonder how that will work. Eraser. Energy shotgun. There we go. More energy weapons. The shotguns so far didn't impress me though. Precision. Energy precision rifle. Okay. The chrome puncher is a modified piercing precision U plus sports rifle made for competition shooting. This joyrunner creation is improved to perforate any aug depth. Augged up, fucker refusing to stand down when told nicely. Step back, take your time and enjoy your kill. 
I mean, I'm kind of down to try out the sniper rifle. Low DPS, really good damage on shots. 8 clip size. 200 knock. Uh, I mean, 15k is not that bad. Excessive. Sure. I'm just gonna try it out. So, I mean, it would make sense to have the sniper rifle and, and the pistol. Because this is inaccurate, but the damage is crazy good. And this is gonna be at a long range. But it's just we don't have full auto guns. We're just gonna be testing out stuff. But now if I want to upgrade... We do have a lot of points. But see, if I don't like the weapon... Hmm... I would have to definitely test it out. Like the pistol, the pistol keeps being really good. That's pretty expensive to upgrade this. I don't know when you need to use the other parts. Right now it just says price. Hmm. Because I did find like the advanced parts. This is the basic ones. This looks pretty badass now. Sniper rifle. Let me show you the beauty of Kalam engineering. I don't know how to change. This is weird, like weapon. If I click any of this, I'm just gonna upgrade this. How do I change the skin on the sniper rifle, for example? It changes it for the pistol only now. Alright, or I guess maybe you just change the skin for both weapons at the same time. Maybe that's how it works. I also had more skins. I don't know where they are. Definitely had more skins before. Okay, let's just go. Side missions. One more rep. So this is gonna be now... Here, I guess. Dark Horse. Silly... Okay. It's all in there, but the exotic dinner is twenty level 23. What level am I? 14, okay. Lost and found. Oh, we have to go back to the guy. I didn't even do that. Humidity doctor. Oh, that's right there. Level 13. We can actually go for a 25. That's out of my league. Okay, let's go to this guy main mission. He will probably send me somewhere. Where I have more side missions to do it anyway. You know what time it is. Okay, please jackpot though. There we go. And we are leaving. Big win, big win. So, here's the deal. The AGI is still quiet. Amazing as that is. Rival CGTs are already coming into the Arcology to pick the bones clean. We have a chance of true independence here, but we have to act faster than an amped out feral before some enterprising CGT gobbles up our cluster and our in-dead contracts with it. 
One of the bulb heads you rescued from Malhor's Gelb claims we can funnel energy covertly from the old Tokamak down in the deep stink. He says we have a small window of opportunity to do this now before the reactor is appropriated by some other corporation. I'd rather control the entire Tokamak, but we have nowhere near the know-how or equipment to do a property grab like that. You need an AGI for that kind of thing. But if you do this right, the new owners won't notice our little arrangement. I'm not fluent in tech blab, but enough to say that this will be a tricky feral to tame. The bulbhead spoke of installing a double redundancy board through the Takamak ice, soft and hardware. So, you'll have to do this on site. The new owners can't know about the board, or they'll shut it down faster than another orgasms. We can then use that energy to bolster our automated security systems. I already have a code jockey reworking schemata to allow for that. And let the CGTs come. When the turrets are done, we'll scavenge their stiffs for ours. Now the ball bed is just that, completely worthless for anything outside a lab. I want you to handle the practical side of things. Get that Takamak working for us. I've uploaded the particulars to your end. Questions? Okay. Yeah, thick enough to fry your neuron solid if you ain't careful. And no wonder you don't want it to be easy to mess with a fucking fusion reactor. Corpsec has always relied on automated security systems to keep order. We're gonna repurpose some of it for our own protection. Those turrets pack a serious punch, but we'll need more energy for it to work. That NG ripped off to the end. They all do. We're still missing five indents. All of them worked at the XMAT lab in the rest dev zone. Could be they just up and disappeared at the same time. I don't believe in coincidences, but what can we do? We can't save them all. If we can just prevent the CGTs from grabbing our stack cluster for long enough, our indent contracts will be voided. That's true independence. Never heard of a corporate grab team? They're specialists, elite. Whenever a corporation collapses, they go in and grab property for their employers. I have no clue how it's done. Wish we could do it ourselves, but you know what wishes are like, right? Right? Yup. Same trusty old RBM5 Fusion Takamak, which keeps our stacks lit at night. I know you're a sewage specialist, but that makes you perfect for this job. It's all about valves and pipes and stubborn SIs. Yeah, you know, fighting ferals, avoiding gun turrets, pushing buttons, uh, possibly exposing yourself to lethal doses of radiation. Practical. Let's go. Good. Let's get it done. Yeah, we definitely have to keep pushing main missions. Like, it's gonna probably unlock more more hacking. Also. Oh shit! What the hell? What did I not find this before? Okay. Another main mission then. Maybe some side missions on the on the way. Yeah, I'm not gonna be spending my points upgrading any weapon right now because I just have to test them out. Test the sniper rifle. If it's any good. I can spend money and buy it. To try it out, but I'm not gonna be spending. Okay, that went through him. It shoots pretty fast. I mean, it's crazy accurate. But those guys are so low level, like, I mean. So let's look at the damage. Okay, I like how it shoots. Chrome Puncher. 100 to 150 per shot, and it's not even upgraded. I mean, yeah. It is pretty good. I like that sniper rifle quite a lot. Reload is very fast, too. You can keep shooting like this, too, without even aiming. Okay, I, I really like that. 
I really like the sniper rifle. I'm just uh, heading back to the upgrade guy. He's there. Wait, I can run through here, I think. Yeah. Let's upgrade the sniper rifle. Why not? If you got the pieces? I don't know about the rocket launchers. Rocket launchers, like the explosions can do a lot of damage, but... It's just like, you have to hold it to keep shooting rockets. I just don't know, man. In this game, you definitely have to just move, keep moving. Just standing still and shooting rockets that are not... Yeah, just the damage is... Look at the damage on the sniper rifle instead. I'm gonna upgrade the sniper rifle quite a bunch. Why not? Could be upgrading the pistol too. I really like the... Oh, but if we run into something that's like... Has defense against the... Energy guns, then I'm kinda... Then I'm kinda fucked. Let's upgrade the sniper rifle more. Why not? Oh look, funds? Now it says four. I'm assuming this is different parts. Yeah, okay. So that's the last step, then you have advanced parts. There are different cogs, see? Okay. Cool, so the five points is the last part. So, the next time we find a basic part, we're just gonna max out the energy pistol and then we have to wait for the advanced ones. Yeah, the sniper rifle is pretty cool. It looks badass. And I mean, the accurate weapons in this game are definitely really, really nice. Up, up close, I can just keep spamming pistol if they swarm me. Okay, you can shoot through multiple people too. That's really good. And it actually rewards me for like aiming straight at them. I like that sniper rifle a lot. It's bad when it comes to just spamming around to hit multiple enemies, but yeah, the sniper rifle is kind of my shit. Being accurate and destroying people in w one shot. I like that. See, I wish the like map the open like this this is cool the mar like sending the marker but i wish it would be easier to look on the map where you have to go and calling the taxi i should be able to like click on the map where i want to go and call the taxi like that okay so we go here deep stink wait isn't this the like under isn't this where the game starts It is. Oh yeah, I remember there was like really high level mutants later on. Okay, I don't know about the sniper rifle against the mutants when there's so many charging you, but we'll see if the laser is gonna go through multiple enemies. If yes, then we're good. like the accuracy man it's so nice when the accuracy is like 100% where you aim in this game definitely the, the like the bloom bullshits you a lot but yeah I have a new power right I have the I have the the explosion, the stomp or whatever. Game, son. Okay, that's gonna be crazy. This power up. I can just keep you. Okay, that power up is crazy. Oh my god! And you can just cause a chain reaction. Oh, that's so good. Now we don't even need that grenade, to be honest.
See, we are getting definitely stronger with this shit. I like that, I like that. Then the grenade comes back so fast now. I guess because I just killed so many enemies. The chain reaction on this is so good. I really like the sniper rifle. Just the energy guns in this game in general. So good. But I'm telling you, 100% there's gonna be later on levels where people have so much resistance to energy, I'm probably gonna be forced to use different kinds of damage. Yeah, the grenade just comes back immediately. Keep forgetting those guys, you can't really aim, fire. Oh, I know why. I'm picking up the those charges for the tactical from the guys. That's why it's goes back so fast. Oh, you can't do it to this guy. Good XP probably fighting those in here. Killing so many of them. Oh yeah, this is where I I tried going before when I was lower level. This is the place. That power up though, that side quest was so worth from the doctor. It's crazy. You're only limited by energy and that's it. Now I kind of have to probably, I'm not really running out, but I probably should put more points in energy cup because the cooldown is so low. It's like five seconds. Sorry, robot bro. I really like the sniper rifle, it's actually makes me aim more and it rewards the aim. It's not spray and hope that the bullets, stray bullets will hit people. Oh, I guess I'm going the wrong way. Was that there? No, oh, 247 port, uh, 47 meters. Oh, this way. Man, the awkward camera angle again. Icebreaker goggles, okay, that's new. Hopefully it's good. That has to be a new item, right? Yeah. 10, 22. That's good. Oh, the stats though. Oh, this is really... Not good. Yeah, losing on the crits. One more, one less of those. Protection is like... 
Not that bad, good protection for the energy stuff, but... Yeah... have that but rarely we got grenade drops I guess we don't care about the radiation even that I'm partially human for sure we're just going into a reactor Mutants living in the reactor. The effects in this game are really well made. And I even lowered them to like medium. Because there's so many explosions and shit the game. Definitely needs some patching. Optimizing. I've seen people with better PCs than mine lagging too, so... I'm glad that we removed the stutters. Completely. I'm just afraid to turn the effects back on to like Ultra or something. This is so good. Like, that ability is broken. But it feels good to be broken in this game, you know? I wonder if you can call the taxi in here. What the? Light monobot? Yo, I thought we were friends. I guess I killed a lot of them accidentally. <laughs> what the hell? There's small robots too? Logbot. What the? Oh, now I could use the EMP grenade, I guess. Okay, the robots are not friends anymore officially. Are those new pants? They are. Plus two for the grenade. Ooh, the stats though. Plus two, really good energy. Oh shit, like in general. Digital and energy, really good. I mean, my attributes I really like. Hmm. It's still free for the frame stuff. Those are really good. The protection on those. That's really good. Because it's all over the... The board. Just protection against everything. Not just fire. Like the other ones. Damn. Those are like suit pants too. Pretty cool. I mean I liked... Having cybernetic legs but... Mm -hmm. 
how those explode like this too. That kind of makes no sense, but... Superior? Is this the... the... energy shotgun? That I didn't buy? Energy Assault Rifle? Whoa, whoa. Energy Assault Rifle. That shoots fast. Damn. For the most part, it's pretty accurate too. I kind of like that. It's like a better version of the of the dread from before. I mean, obviously, dread has more damage here because I was upgrading it multiple times now, and the rest is the same. Yeah, different damage type. No. Okay. I feel like the pistol is still kind of broken, but... And the sniper rifle does so much damage. And it staggers people too. I'm just gonna stick to the sniper rifle for now. Definitely the... the yeah, the, the damage on the sniper rifle. But I can upgrade the rifle. For sure. <laughs> this way, boost cooling system. Well, I guess I missed something in this room. There we go. Yeah, 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 yeah. How about this way now? There we go. Just didn't use the PC. Yeah, I really dig the sniper rifle right now. When there's a lot of chaos going on, definitely like just spraying the rifle is good too. They get one shot. Oh, the small guys don't even. Weird. That's weird. The small guys don't even fly away. The regular robots do. Okay, work jacket. The visuals are great in this game, man. Okay, there we go. What was that jacket? Yeah, it's actually new items now. Let's see, 26 ballistics, 30 fire. We'll lose out 14 energy. 
Okay, we get accuracy to reloading for. Uh, lose out on the other stuff that I don't really care about that much. We might just go for this. Hellfire work jacket. Or two. This gives 4-4, four, four, but the attributes... It's kind of nice to have more ballistics. We lose on the energy. Yeah, I think it's worth. Kind of look weird now, though. I don't look as cool anymore. We have the suit pants, but the top is... Looking kind of weird. Am I... Am I out of energy? What is going on? I can't use the other ability. Couldn't use the other ability for some reason. show the cooldown on the ability. Oh, you get cooldown on bow? Are you... wait. Yeah, it looks like I get cooldown. Or maybe I'm just low on energy. Maybe I am low on energy, yeah. Maybe the shockwave just... takes a lot. I don't think they share a cooldown, there's no way. I was using them both at the same time before. Attention. Hub has been previously altered. User unknown. Initiating alternate bypass. Bypass done. components, nice. Conceal the drain. So far I really like in this game like this. It's slow shooting weapons, but I shoot fast. But I mean, they are supposed to be the slow ones. The, the auto weapons, like you can spray around and stuff, but... The sniper rifle, before it was the, the pistol. That I was spamming with anyway, and the sniper rifle, like... It shoots fast anyway. Just... Oh, of course there has to be like a boss or something. Two of them. Oh damn, okay. Okay, we have to we have to run big time.
Why am I not hitting some of those? Just blindly shooting. And I'm dead. Shit. I mean, we had more fire resistance before. I wonder if the rocket launcher would be better here. It could be that they have big protection against the lasers, for sure. I can try out the rocket launcher. I guess we can go back to the... also to the regular rifle. This one is slow. I could go for the auto rifle too. Watch out. The launcher. Okay. Most I mean, definitely the, like I said, the explosions. Wait, there's one now? <laughs> what the hell? I think that was a bug, I had two bosses before. Yeah, I was wondering, like, in the cutscene what there was one. I literally was fighting two bosses at the same time. Okay. Oh, yo, th those rockets actually home to enemies. What? Huh? Oh, this guy does nothing to him. Be nice to get HP items. Yeah, I was literally fighting two bosses at the same time. And the rocket launcher is the way to go with this guy. All of the small guys explode on him. If there was supposed to be two of them, I think there was supposed to be one. I think before it was bugged, I think now it's the way it should be. I don't think the fire stops in my dome. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was bugged before with two of them. Oh. Okay. I mean, my rockets would do very little damage. I guess they have better rockets. That was refreshing. You should stand down, Indent. We don't want to disintegrate you just yet. Were you trying to create a supernova just now? Because that's what your uninformed meddling with the Taurus containment field would have led to. That your stack boss asked you to do this only confirms his incompetence. Luckily, we are in control now. This tokamak is now the property of Y Corp. So is your stack cluster, and so is every indent registered there, including yourself. Your indentured contracts have been transferred and renewed in accordance with existing agreements and standard protocol, etc., etc. In short, you belong to us for what remains of your pitiful life expectancy. However, while you have demonstrated an alarming lack of cognitive skills, you have also shown an aptitude for applying lethal solutions to conflicted situations. This might be of some use to Y Corp. So, we wish to test your abilities by giving you a special assignment. A trial of sorts. Success will raise you above the filthy mass of regular indents and provide you with certain perks. And you'll be given a chance at earning your freedom. We will set up an operation center in cluster 13. Come find us there. Okay. 
30k XP, nice. Less than 1k. Gold from this guy. For you, creds. Nice, yeah, see, like, some weapons are definitely good to keep. Ooh. Cyclops security helmet. Really good ballistic stuff. I mean, getting HP for critical. I really like criticals. Damn, like... Digital losing 15, but the ballistic protection is so good. That ballistic protection is really nice. Hmm. I mean, you're basically tankier with this. I guess that kind of does help. We can try it out. Kind of look the more cyberpunky look we had before. We definitely keep the. Now we can start keeping one of each kind of weapon. This is basically the same, but those different uh, damage type, and I'm assuming... I mean, I did upgrade the rifle pretty hard before, so maybe it's gonna be more damage on the laser one. Hard to say. Oh, I can't even... So they are in, in like a different town and stuff. There's more chests around, but the question is... I don't know if those chests disappear from the map when you get them. Functional barely, no, it's a gross schedule, maintenance, one cover due. Okay. Oh, there should be a chest here. Oh, look at this, okay. Nice. Spider bots and a rig. Oh shit, okay. The protection on this one. Losing my best stats. Okay. That stuff right here, everything we are putting on right now. Crazy good protection. Like, yeah, it's not even worth... You can basically s scrap the bikes or stuff. I'm gonna keep the, the items that are, like, yellow. I think they're unique. The rest is garbage now. So, Stasi Stomp, I really like. Hyper Focus helps a lot, too. What is this? Spider bots. Deploys multiple explosive spider bots, which will seek out targets. That's kind of cool. Cooldown 30, 65 consumption. Okay, the stomp is very expensive. It has no cooldown at all, but it's expensive. That's why sometimes I can't use it. The stomp is crazy good, though. And I like having a defensive ability. Oh, this... Increase amount of bots. Huh. Scales duration. Increase the stasis duration. Huh. What are my stats right now? Head the 10. It's the lowest. It's not bad, but it's the lowest. Um, the stomp is so good. 
The stomp is so good. That Stasi stuff is so good in the game. I just don't know if I want to get rid of that defensive thing that we have on. Oh, the best defense is often offense, what they say. So, okay, this does disappear. So let's try to get the other chest, I guess. See, with auto rifles, I don't like that it will not reload if I hold the left click. Okay, the sniper rifle is so good, it just pierces through enemies too. I like the sniper rifle the best right now. So we are locked out here. I could check out this area, I, I don't think I went there before. Yeah, the stasis in this game is crazy good, so... Having an ability you can always use when you have energy is good. Okay, I kinda want to get all the chests here. If we can reach them. This is the place where I was before. I guess I missed one? I missed the chest. put it on one guy but it's still pretty good oh. card distribution so we cannot reach that can't even hack anything surprisingly maybe it's for later I guess can we call the taxi here we can wait archaeology deep sink oh you can go to different areas But, uh, uh, oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I guess, oh, that kind of works out. I don't have to run back. Uh, oh, yeah, those are the guys. Just armored now, we don't really look like a badass, no armor, Robocop guy. Let's see then. Mm, have a quest here. Okay, so they have a camp in this town. Oh, the bug for the guy, that's in there, different area. Team down, it's here. It's a level 5 quest, apparently.
I wonder if I should, if I should upgrade the rifle now too. The sniper is definitely something I like for sure. What is this on the map? Oh, boss. Okay, the exploding spiders are pretty good. Oh, I think they are dropping new items. That's a new chest plate, right? Oh no, never mind. It isn't. Oh, I have two bounties to sell. I kinda liked having a defensive- oh, another bounty. Just two-shotting him. This is still something we can go to. If you got any nice catch, nice catch. Did he put up a fight? No, he got too short. Really you, you creds. Well, why did you ask then? Oh, was I not able to? Oh, I think I was able to go here. Oh yeah, this is the beginning area. Oh, in there there is also loot I think that only the robot could reach, unless I got it already. Did I get it? I didn't. I'm assuming this is something you collect with the little robot guy. Stomp for Luton. Oh, and they remove all energy, so I have to wait. Oh, you can run? Oh my god, really? How did I not see it earlier that you can actually run in there? Okay, so I don't think in this game there's actually areas where only the drone can reach it. I think we're gonna go Stasi Stomp Spider Bots. It's a lot of energy consumption for sure. But when the like enemies drop the packs of energy and you can spam stuff, those two are they seem really cool. I like one shooting everyone with the sniper rifle. Is it safe? I wish you could just break stuff and it would auto pick up. You like break, then you have to go back because it falls on the ground. Pretty annoying. Even if I had the robot equipped, he's not that great at picking up loot. He picks, picks it up one by one, by one very slowly. What? Why is it sending me here? Oh, is it above me? No, we can't go there. Wait, it's showing me this chest, and I, I mean, I looked at it before. Oh no, is this quest bugged? Kinda looks like it could be on the table up there, but... Oh wait, it shows... Oh. 
the hell? Access denied, really? This game is weird sometimes, man. And it's like a level 5 quest, that makes no sense. And I have access denied to that place. It's like literally right there. Some... Security. Is this even the Steam Town place? I don't think so. That's so weird. It kind of feels like it's on the table that I can see there in the club. Oh, maybe the Steam Town is the different area though. Like, this is not Steam Town, I think. Oh, weird. Oh, wasted time on that one. Just keep going, main mission then. Data miner. Okay, I mean... Apparently that is next to me too, so... That kind of works out. Or it doesn't, because it again shows me, like, what is this shit? Yeah, I'm telling you, navigation in this game is busted. It's like, it's under me in the town or something. I don't even know if I should fast travel now. Or not. No, there's no really... What? I mean... Yeah. Those quests are just bugging out like crazy. Sometimes they don't show where you have to even go. Oh yeah, see like it's all showing in the same spot right here. Okay, yeah, that's completely bugged then. Unless some of them... No, the liver bug. This is a different area, yeah. Those those markers are just bugged. I'm just taking the taxi and leaving. We're gonna go... I guess I can turn in the quest. Arcology the Warrens. Yeah, that's just bugged. and found. See, now it actually shows you have to go here. Exotic dinner. But this one more rep thing is like here. No, let's not do that one yet. I think it is just bugged. I think the steam town might be the locked area and when I was there like all the other markers for the quest bugged out go for the main mission we have like two or three days until death trash comes out in early access. I don't know how much content there is going to be in early access though. I'm really looking forward to playing Death Trash 2. And I don't want to rush this game, I really enjoy it. Then, you know, we have the beta for Back for Blood, and that stuff is limited, so... You know how it is, I just want to squeeze in all the games I want to play. And it's... I'm, I'm fine with having a lot of games to play. I was afraid there's gonna be a month of nothing... If you before... The pieces, I... Before the... Sweden? 
Can't even really see the colors here. I guess the laser here changes the colors too. Doesn't look bad. The swagger kind of doesn't look good on the sniper rifle. Uh, I don't really know. Oh, I guess uh, this is uh, like the Swedish flag or something, right? If you got the pe weapon skin, swag. Just the swag looked cool on the other guns. Not right now, though. I think it's still the best one I have. Okay, let's think here. Oh, I ballistic SMG hard. Oh yeah, that's the one I wanted to kind of test out. We might actually see if it's anything worth a while. We have only one advanced part, we need five to keep upgrading the sniper rifle, it's maxed for now. Oh, the regular ones we have one too, so we literally cannot upgrade anything. But... I think I'm still gonna try out the SMG here. So, see like it shows this SMG actually does more DPS than the other gun. We're gonna try it out. I feel like all those inaccurate fast shooting guns are not that great in the game, but... The Fist. Oh, he has new guns now too. Ballistic Shotgun. I, I'm i gonna be trying them out when I find them on the ground and stuff, but... I don't feel the shotguns in this game. Bore Shot. Ballistic Precision Rifle. So it should slower. I mean, why, why would I get it? I guess there's just gonna be some enemies that are will probably have more defense against energy, and that's why you kind of want to mix it a little bit. Oh, minigun, strike breaker. Oh, that's expensive too. I don't know how I feel about the heavy weapons in this game, though. Two hundred bullets in the mag. Apparently it does more DPS, I mean, but you have to... The thing is, you have to keep hitting. You have to keep hitting. I kind of want to try it out, but I mean, it's really expensive. I guess... I mean, what else do I spend money on? Fuck it. I wanted to try out the SMG too. Let's sell the stuff we're not gonna be using. Kill ball vest. Sounds cool, but... Yeah, and the defense is not worth. Sell all of that. Sell the extra guns. I think I'm gonna keep one of each for now. Yeah, and I'm like not low on cash or anything. Speak with Kira. Oh, wait, is this the shop? That was... Oh, yeah. This is the shop that was closed before. See, I told you. Definitely, eventually, this is gonna be... Yeah? Oh, it was advanced component. Nice. Finally. Y Corp is looking to expand its property appropriation division. And you fit the profile. Barely. If you complete our test assignment, you'll be given a position with one of our corporate grab teams, as the indents call them. I detest the term, but it does describe the work we do. We seek out contested property and transfer ownership of it to White Warp. Sometimes a competing team is after the same property. Then we flatline them. It can be quite satisfying. There are more perks, 
As a Y Corp CGT operative, you'll have access to select gear, and you'll be covered by a premium Y Corp insurance policy. <laughs> insurance? So, like, if you die, you get money? <laughs> I mean, I don't like working with, like, feds or whatever they are. Corporations, but I'm about the good gear. But first, you have to complete this assignment. We want the complete Ascent Group operations history. It is stored in one of their data vaults. You must locate the correct vault, re-imprint the vault SI, and upload the desired data to our AGI. Complete this assignment, and you'll get a shot at earning your freedom further down the line. Your success will depend on your brawn trumping your inferior sapiens brain. We expect this will be a considerable challenge. Our comms records show you've already collaborated with that notorious ice fiend Noghead. We suggest enlisting his aid again. Questions? When a corporation defaults on Velez, there is no regulatory body governing its demise. Damn, this like really hurts my eyes. Just flashing like that, they should give you a warning the about epilepsy. That corporation can, from that moment, be appropriated or taken by any other corporation with the capabilities to do so. We won't burden you with the technicalities, but in short, the process involves imprinting the property governing SI so that it answers only to the new owner. Like the other multi-corps, Y-Corp is looking to rapidly expand its holdings within this arcology. Acquiring the Ascent Group operations history will help us prioritize what property to target next. The Ascent Group also rented vault space to other corporations on Velez. Expect a slew of auto defenses operating at maximum lethality as well as rival CGTs looking to protect their corporate data. For the time being, Y Corp intends to keep a low profile, so you will have to gain access on your own. Yes, SI imprinting is an extremely delicate procedure. Your imp will be bonded to our AGI, which will perform the actual imprinting. We require you to jack in directly to the SI on site, and our AGI will do the rest. And before you ask, yes, Y Corp has its own AGI. It's a Gen 12, and yes, your access to it will be severely restricted. Hmm. Y Corp has certain long-term objectives. If you are instrumental in achieving those objectives, we will offer to void your indentured contract and register you as an independent contractor. Yeah, independent, I bet. You'll be a free being. As much as anyone is free on Pelez. Very well. We have taken the liberty of bonding your imp with our AGI through the local data nodes. You should expect a slight performance boost. Now get going. Hmm, printing. What? You were saying something different. The AI was saying something different on the screen. Recruit the help of Noghead. SMG. When you start shooting, it's pretty accurate, then it just goes to shit. I mean, this might not be a bad gun. Oh, we leveled up too. Uh, kinda. Hmm. Weapon handling probably should go higher. Aiming. Evasion definitely boosts. No, now cybernetics. Boost the the spider thing, and having the grenade more often would be nice too. But the critical hit rate, so good. Now it boosts my cybernetics, so I kind of care about that. Oh, we just got more components right now. Where did I get those? The hell? I don't think I ever had the tier 3 yet. Damn, we got a lot of this shit, so... I should probably... 
to upgrade, but we have to test this SMG and the mini guy I just bought. Mini gun I bought. <laughs> this looks pretty intense. See, the problem is the slow walking and inaccuracy. Okay, Riddle is not that bad for 200 bullets. I just like rolling around a lot and sniping. But I spent so much money on this minigun, we have to try it out at least. One more step. Can definitely. I see like so many misses. I would just need to put the shield on too. You just hold it sideways. I mean, when there's gonna be a lot of things running towards me. Oh, you can break those things. Okay, I didn't even know. Yeah, yeah. Collateral damage using a minigun. I guess I'm gonna try to avoid it. It's not that bad. I, just, I can just keep shooting and shooting. They're really not that bad, but I mean, those are low-level guys, so I can just stand and shoot. And when it comes to, like, high-level guys, and you don't avoid their shots, you're kind of toast. But I do kind of like the idea of having a minigun. That is pretty sick. I just don't like being so slow, you know? I would definitely need abilities like just... Are they teaching me that stuff right now? Did I really... Just not do enough main missions? I feel like it sh should not be giving those. It's like repeats the old... Tutorials. At this, there's no way at this point they would be teaching me about that stuff. See like how many times you can miss? Yeah. And like you look at this. Boom. 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 Okay, they don't get one shot in here, so. Okay, so minigun is pretty good here one. They don't get one shot by the sniper rifle. You can just use both. I mean, it's a good thing to have a weapon with ballistic damage and energy weapon. There's things with protection for one of those. I just don't like not being very mobile while holding a machine gun, but... Yeah, I feel like that's a good combo. Quickly run around, rolling, sniping, different en uh, ammo type energy. And then spraying the machine gun. Not bad. I'm gonna actually test the SMG. Why not? I don't think it's gonna be as good as the machine gun. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, it's... It basically does what the machine gun does, but worse. But, I mean... You can move. You do move full speed. That's the thing. This is like the only weapon where you don't move full speed. Very slow. They're basically like you. 
basically like aiming down the side. But yeah, when people get close to you, like those melee guys or anyone, you actually do clear them quite fast. Like, I mean, those guys cannot reach me. That's pretty good. The fact they cannot reach me because of the knockback. Yeah. Tell anyone when you're dead. <laughs> Effects in this game. There's so many good things about this game. There's definitely some bugs here and there. Like after they patch it. Especially the Xbox Pass version. I'm playing on the Steam version. Because the Xbox Pass version after the first day I tried was so bad. Some patches here and there in this game is so good. I don't think there is gonna be <laughs> avoiding casualties. I, I don't even remember to use my power-ups to be honest with you. I just completely forget. Completely forgot to use my power ups. I'm just okay. This guy completely stopped working. Why is this robot? Okay, I was just killing them too fast. He couldn't blow up on anyone. do like the machine gun i can't wait to like get some crazy power armor you know me playing fallouts and stuff like brotherhood of steel enclave just being a beefy boy with a machine gun is pretty fun travel point now here oh yeah oh yeah moments like this with the small guys like they stand no chance to the minigun I definitely have to use my abilities more often. I think they exploded being off the screen. No, they didn't. There's, there's so many good games this year. Finally. There's been many years when... We had some good games, but... No, oh, there's some chests you just cannot interact with. They clearly look like a chest with loot. Strange. Now I'm more like... I should be probably spamming the spiders, I think, now. I feel... Huh. I really like the disintegrate stomp. I really do, but it's more like a pass playing ability. Yeah, 
It's really, really good, but I feel like I should be using the, the shield. Walking slowly with a machine gun like this. It should have the defensive ability on. And then I can keep spamming the spiders too, I guess. Maybe let's do that. It feels bad removing the stasis stump. It's really good. That is really good. But like I should be just putting the shield on me and spraying with machine gun. You know what I mean? Just going in. Oh, we go back to this place. That was the Nog head, I forgot about this guy. Jamaican music. Place. You again. What does Poon want now? Oh, hang on. Who the fuck is Y Corp? They want you to appropriate an Ascent Group data vault. I don't do appropriations, pal. I'm pretty damn good, but that SI would nerf my ass before I even got past the outer ice layer. They have their own AGI? I'm not sure you understand, pal. Only the largest multicorps have their own AGIs. And you tell me your imp is fucking bonded with one? Let me see. Wow. That's some beautiful code. There's a, a cold elegance to AGI where that us orgs can only dream of achieving. But then I don't get what you need me for. Their AGI can crack open a vault like a Ponto nut. Why don't you have it do that in the imprinting? But Y Corp have their own AGI and yet they want to keep a low profile? Well, whatever. I can get you in, all right. But seeing as this is a corporate job, I won't do it pro bono. And again, I gotta admit, I'm real curious about what's going on here. Might be worth helping out just to get some insight and maybe even link to that AGI at some point. Okay. Let's just say you'll owe me for this one. I've revived my comm tag on your imp so we can stay in touch. Best get cracking, my friend. I'm gonna do a deep trawl for anything Y Corp related in the meantime. I wanna know who we're dealing with. Cool. If you got the pieces. Yeah, I think we're gonna upgrade the minigun. Sure, yeah, let's let's just upgrade the minigun more. We do have a lot of parts. We could go even more into the sniper rifle now. I do like it. I do like the sniper rifle. Price is one for this. I mean, might as well. It starts the same way now, yeah. Then I don't know if I'm gonna be upgrading more of the minigun. I like both playstyles. Rolling and sniping. That minigun shreds too, though. Chrome puncher. Hmm. Let's let's not upgrade it more yet. Ready to jack it. Auto turret. Turret automatically tracks and attacks enemies with, within range. I mean, that's pretty cool sounding. I feel like it could be worth. It's all my money. <laughs> uh, it's literally all my money. It could be better than this grenade. I really like the chain explosions. The question is how much the turret... ...does. Fuck it. Okay. The pistol. Good. 
Could I? I don't think I equipped the. I don't think I equipped the. Uh, yep. Auto turret. Let's try it out. Kind of looks. Sounds cool. You know, me putting a shield on, spraying minigun, throwing down an auto turret. It's kind of cool to have something that does the stuff for you. We'll see. Definitely the, the the energy ability with the Stasi stuff is extremely overpowered if there's a lot of energy drops from enemies. You can just spam it. But at the same time, I could be just throwing down the spiders and having armor on me while shooting everything that moves. You know, I'm kinda exposed to range when I'm machine gunning. I'm just not moving fast. Where am I going? See, again, I don't see a marker. Okay, we're going here. So, our Corology the Warrens. See? When I, when I can't see that, then... Plus traveling definitely helps. Wait, do we go deep stink again? Really? Oh, there is a lot of... I mean, the... There is a lot of locations so far in this game, but there's definitely a lot of going back to the same ones too. Okay, so now we're going where I wanted to go before and I didn't have access, right? I would assume. Maybe a different way. I kind of look cooler with the sniper. I guess we are blowing it up. Man, this game is so good looking and the vibe and the music is mind blowing that like 12 people made it. Lots of chests to grab. I'm sure there's turrets everywhere. Now the EMP grenades would be probably good. Man, missing like that, that's kinda rough. I'm assuming the energy weapons probably are bad for robots, huh? I mean, I do a lot of damage to them right here. I feel like in here. I should not be using the machine gun. Has to be the main missions that will let me use better hacking. Has to be. Yeah. 
yeah, the machine gun here is really... Okay, maybe, I guess maybe their energy weapons are good against the robots. I thought they were gonna be weak, but... Maybe it's the opposite. We have to go here, it shows me like... Go there. I can't see the spiders even. He was like highlighted through the textures, but just couldn't see it. Why does it tell me to go back? I'm gonna trust the game that it knows better. Right now, with those guys being tanky, I don't really see the value in the machine gun. Okay. Up close, though, you just have to hit the shots. I think I just have to spam levels into what it's called aiming. Like that, there's the spread reduction. I think that's it. Definitely machine gun, you have to have a lot of defensive abilities. It's a big downside, you can move fast. take so many hits with this though they might have a lot of energy protection though okay. okay okay some of the situations definitely when there's a big group of enemies spraying machine gun at them when it's like impossible to miss definitely works out But I do take a lot of damage. Standing still spraying. You just have to keep switching weapons. I mean, that's why we have two types. Go. Yeah, I like this combo. This fast sniper rifle, energy, a slow well machine gun. Now appropriate the vault itself. Jack into the vault SI, and our AGI will do the rest through your imp. It's 
see another cyber deck upgrade. Plug. I have so many cyber deck upgrades, it's kind of weird. Am I missing something? It's just... Keep getting cyber deck upgrades, but we, we... Can't really use any hacking or anything like that. Data crunch visor. Data crunch visor. Okay. Five body, We're losing one on legs, three. I mean, losing on HP. And that ballistic. But 20 more. Hmm, it's pretty good, pretty good. Not exactly the stats I want. Oh damn, okay, this looks amazing, let's go. Going with that for sure. There's just so many ballistic type enemies so far. I see other CGTs moving in on your position. The bastards are just cruising through now that we cleared the way. Better watch your six now. Intent. If you lose that vault, I expect you to sell terminate on the spot and spare me the effort. Clear? <laughs> There's a lot of spiders there. Okay, my spiders definitely jump for enemies that already died, that's kind of fun. shooting at them. Oh, now it shoots. I fucking died. No, man. In, in this game, definitely a problem is like you can't really tell. The UI is so small. I like that the UI is not like very intrusive, but you, there's never a way of telling. And the music is blasting and everything. If you're low health, if you're low on energy, if a cooldown is up. See, that's the problem with the machine gun, though. Just like way too stationary. If I was rolling there and sniping, I would not be taking that much damage. That sucks. That does suck. Okay, 
Okay, they should know with the laser guns. Like I said before. But probably eventually people will have more guns. Not using the ballistic damage. Okay, but they have a lot of protection against it too. The turret shreds when it actually shoots them. You just have to use the shield when you spray with machine gun. You take too much damage. Okay. So we do it here. Accessing vault data. That data pack is gonna be crazy large, buddy. Even with compression, your imp doesn't have enough bandwidth for a remote transfer. I'll set up access to the network operations center while ah, shit. Compiled. While we appreciate the assistance, Knockhead, you should be aware that we are monitoring your every action. Don't get any ideas. Far be it for me to enact on any ideas, or there's an foreign involved. Just help it out, my pal, as promised. Good. So many years ahead in the future and they still have internet problems? Damn. Okay, we cannot open this one. Now. 
I guess Elon Elon didn't succeed with the Starlink. Yeah, speaking of Starlink, I heard that uh, you know. The operations data has significant gaps, but our AGI was able to cross-reference it with the information we already had, and the findings are interesting. Our board will want to discuss them before deciding how to proceed. In the meantime, you pass the test. We cool. reluctantly welcome you to our property appropriation division. Be aware that you'll be operating in a whole different league going forward. This is a high-risk, high-reward profession, and we expect you to perform at the highest possible standard at all times. We have updated your imp with your new rating as a CGT operative. Enjoy the insurance policy, and expect to hear from us again soon. I heard Starlink is good on paper and all, but... Good. I set up this channel to bypass the ping is very high, so it's a bad option. I had a pilfering algorithm piggybacking on the transfer so that I could clone the data. Just a little something I've been working on for a while now. Thing is, she ain't telling you half of it. There's clues in there as to why the Ascent Group went under. Looks like they were pouring you creds into some secret mega project enough to buy a fucking planet. A lot of key personnel were being reassigned to that same project, and they also paid Onyx Void plenty of you creds for who knows what. Why the hell would Ascent Group do that? What were they working on, and why is Y Corp so interested? AG, we're also planning a hostile takeover of Malor's Gel, but something went seriously wrong somewhere, and the Ascent Group AGI shut down. The whole court went belly up, and here we are. Figured you should know, seeing as it's your eyes on the line. Talk soon! Okay. Is the mission over? Can I, like, take a taxi out of here, or...? I'm assuming yes. Objectives. Uh, I think we just have to wait for it to, like, finish. And a low health here. And all the stuff respawned. I think we just have to... Okay, if we can't take the taxi, so... We just have to exit this place, I guess. Oh. Dead. Oh my god, they are on a leash and they get all the HP back, that's so stupid. Literally, you move a little bit and the guy gets all his HP back. Damn, Luton, we already have that. Advanced component though, that's good. For weapon upgrades. about to die though if even more respawns The mission just didn't update. I'm assuming we have to get a call or something. Okay. 
now we have your destination tactical frogmaster grenade i like the turret i mean it takes more charge than anything else well, i guess the Regio field is better. Kill could be good, but it heals everything in, in range. But it could be like a good thing or, you know. Like the last time after the fight I had no health. No health pickups. But the turret seems to be good. It does good damage if it actually shoots people. Cool, cool. Where are we? I'm like... I want to see the stores if they have new equipment. Before you have different endings in the game if you kill too many civilians. Where the fuck am I even going? This is the town. Wait, I am... Am I going to the town? I am. I think I am. Yeah, this is the part of the town. I kind of wish that the, like, the fast traveling system and all that stuff would be a little better. So I could just go to like fast travel to a store and stuff. The towns are nice. But you know, after many times coming back to the same spot. You would like to just teleport fast to the store. Okay, so the visor... Here is just way worse. At this point we just sell that stuff. Okay, only those two we keep. Yeah, energy protection is really nice now when... Apparently this is more expensive. But yeah, it's just uh, the energy protection now. I feel like it's better because they use energy guns now. Sell those pants. Yeah, the trousers are way worse now too. the extras or oh, the handgun and sex dick so just get rid of it completely machine gun dominator Ma uh, the machine guns are pretty bad compared to a minigun but maybe you move faster with this one i'm not, I'm not sure not sure there about that if you got the piece Here are seven of those. Uh, minigun, prize funds. There we go. Okay, five. And now we can go. I mean... I just feel like minigun and the sniper rifle are both good in different moments. I should just slowly upgrade both. I'm just gonna get both. Up and keep the rest. Pinnacle. We had the pinnacle before and then it disappeared. Now we have the pinnacle again. I feel like this is the best skin for the weapons. Yeah, it's pretty sick looking. Oh, we have a lot of bounties to sell. And level ups too. Okay, so my current stuff. 
Spider bots are cybernetics and the focus is frame. Reload speed on minigun definitely would help. You can at least put one point in it. Probably should get more health if I'm gonna be spraying a minigun. Probably should get a lot of more health for that stuff. I don't know if I should keep pumping aiming if like a minigun spread is crazy anyway. And sniper rifle doesn't have spread at all. Crit hit rate though, like... Probably still, like, it's cybernetics too, so... At the same time... I could be using the... Turret more often if the tactical sense was higher. The frame for the length of the shield is nice too. That's like, rolling more often. Go like this. Oh, is my, oh, my side color... Wait, wait a second. We can change that stuff here for free. I think this is like red-ish because my side color is red. No, I think I did everything... Luck. Oh, he has new stuff. Homing me, I am. Locks on to nearby enemies and fires homing missiles. Barrage size determined by other subsystems. That sounds cool. Neutron beam. A continuous energy beam which pierces armor and causes massive damage. Mono Ranger deploys a monobot armed with a rifle. Light monobot focused on close combat. Spider bots convert their weapons, projectiles, and explosions now deal digital damage only. All your damage output to aggressive cyber strikes. Which, which can quickly overwhelm vulnerable enemies. Huh. Interesting. So the spiders are really nice. They have a long cooldown. I just don't know if I should invest in like... And definitely sell more stuff, and I could afford that. 33k for the rockets. I wonder just barrage size determined by other subsystems, but kind of sounds good. Sounds like a better version of ro of the spiders. Like any any robots or anything like that that fights for you. That kind of they have health, so they can die for sure. Like the turret I plays, and the turret kinda doesn't shoot everything, it just takes its time, but it does good damage. I feel like those missiles could be good. Oh, modules! Hell yeah! Recharge the tactical equipment faster. Get extra health for all he healing pickups and abilities. Execute extreme evasive maneuvers instead of a regular roll. Oh, like a... Oh, that's gonna be like a... Um, teleport forward or something like that. What I, what we've seen in the trailers, I think. A fixed percentage of melee damage gets thrown back to your attacker. Ah, uh, Extra health. I feel like I kinda want the dash. I kinda want to test the dash out. It's like a charge. I wonder if this does damage to people. If you can like do it shooting or something like that with a minigun, that would be OP. That would be crazy good. I think I sold everything. Yeah, I just didn't. 
sell the bounties. The ballistic machine gun. I mean, I could sell this one. The minigun is just better. I guess knockback is small on the minigun, surprisingly. That's the only better thing about the Dominator. I'm gonna sell it there. Energy Assault Rifle. Kinda want the rockets. Nothing new. This is the feed with your humble Now it would kinda of be better to be able to roll more too. The cooldown on that stuff. I wonder how good this is. The dash. Kinda of feels faster. Six crit. This is the one we have. Jammer hat. Ooh. That looks slick. Just full. Attributes the health one. I don't feel like I should spend any money on clothes. Oh, this has great stats, but it's only free. Huh. This is great defense. This is a really great defense, but you lose out on reload speed and accuracy. And you get free. I mean, I do need... I do need... That start. So the shield lasts longer. And I should be more tanky. Man, but like losing 4 reload. Is pretty big for the machine gun and stuff. That is pretty big. Hmm... Just all out, like, on the entire board, all the stats are better though. Just less boosts. I think I'm gonna buy it, just at least for the defense. And the uh, legs... I think only those two are new, yeah. Nothing compares to the ones I have. Okay, that kind of fits the... the theme of using a machine gun too. Could sell the rest, get more money. Could sell the rest. 1.8. Way more ballistic defense. The stats are just way, way worse. Mm, we don't need money that bad. I'm not gonna be able to buy the rockets anyway. Unless, like, I sold the automatic rocket launcher and shit. The automatic rocket launcher kinda sucks, actually. It's 10... 10k. 
can just keep the regular one, just in case. It saved my ass once. Can shoot 30 rockets though, I mean... I'm just gonna keep them, there's no way, no reason to like, sell a bunch of stuff. We can just make money and buy the, the rockets. I kinda want them though, I kinda want them fast. How much are they? Can I even afford if I sell stuff? Uh, oh, it's under me. If I can afford the rocket ability after selling the rest of my stuff, and I will get it. How do I go there? From here? Elevator. How much is this? Okay, so we need 27. Less than that. I can't afford this, I think. Yeah, none of that. I'm just gonna get 10k from the rocket launcher. Yeah, we just have to make more money. I could sell the Razor Dronettes. This one sucks. I really don't like the Dronettes. I'm gonna sell this. Automatic rocket launcher. Yeah, 9k, 9.5. I mean, I can sell both of those, I guess. I don't think there's a reason to keep other gear if I'm not gonna be switching it. Three and a half K. I guess I can sell Dread for now. I would just have to sell the weapons. Oh, this better be good. It's probably not even worth. Instead of spider bots. We will see. Motorix increases amount of missiles. I think my Motorix is actually really good. Yeah, upper body 22. See, so... We'll see how many rockets and how good they are. We look pretty badass, I'm gonna lie. I really like the setup right now. Wait, new stuff? No, that's just... Okay, that's a bug. Didn't really get anything new. Okay, I have both black on the color. Yeah. 
this will be it just sucks you. Like, it kind of looks good, block. There's some red elements. It just kind of sucks they don't show you your armor when you change stuff. This is kind of dumb to reset skills 80k. Or does it the pants then? And the chest is black. Mm, I kind of like fu like full black and the red elements. Just go back and go. Sky block. At least that's for free. We have a lot of things to test out. How the dodge works. It looks pretty badass. The rockets. Okay, side missions. Let's go. Steam Town. The morgue. Didn't even turn in the quest with the luggage for this guy. We don't even have money for taxi. Onyx Void Chapter House. Okay, so we can do the side mission there too. I mean, finish the side mission. I do wonder how this is gonna work. If I do damage, bumping into people, or... Okay, it kinda looks like I can keep shooting after dodge. That that could be that could be crazy. Like it there's I just can hold. Yeah. I can keep shooting. Holding left left mouse button and dodging. I would just have to invest more into the dodge cooldown to be able to do it more often well, I like the setup right now for sure ah man see the problem with another ability right now it just like all went into one guy and there was more enemies around. It's kinda like the spiders jumping into dead enemies. Okay, we can dodge around a lot while shooting the machine gun. That's actually dodge is crazy good for me. With my current weapon. That new dodge is really good. But the rockets, I spent so much money. We'll, we'll see. We'll see when there is a lot of enemies around. Oh! See? This time it worked. This time it worked really good. Okay. Okay. So it's gonna be buggy, but when it works, it works. What sucks is you have to like stand still, but that's why we have to use the shield and then use the rockets. For the taxi. Mm. Guys, the corp zone. We can't even really. I could teleport here. Oh, insufficient, yeah. We don't have 1k for a taxi. Because Batman. Wait, umbilical? Wait, the camera is here. For the side mission. What's right here? The hell? See, like... Oh shit, okay, there is... 
I'm gonna keep misclicking. Maybe I should swap. I guess that's why I didn't go here before. High level guys. Damn, if they traveled far too, that would be nice. There's a guy above me. Okay, I kind of like the current setup. Okay, we can dodge reloading too. Uh, I don't know if I was low health, someone killed me, or did I kill myself with the rockets? Is it even possible? Oh, we actually respawned in the same spot. I keep misclicking, man. I have to like rebind. I like dodged last time into a mine or something. Oh, they have shields on them. The part. Have to get used to the buttons, I guess. Q is the shield. I just keep pressing E, and E is the rockets. Then you're a sitting duck. Okay, why is it showing me the other way to go now? Oh, it's I need to go up. I'm dead. I couldn't even. I got stuck on the fucking stairs too. That's annoying. The get, getting stuck on invisible stuff in this game is really annoying. Alright, I like the rockets, but they definitely just... They just have to hit. You know? Those guys are pretty tanky. Up uh, close they melt though. If you just don't miss with the minigun, people die in no time. But they spray some miniguns too, so... They do the same amount of damage to me. doesn't do that much damage to them, so minigun is pretty good.
You just have to literally crouch behind something and keep shooting. I guess I didn't really think about that earlier that with a machine gun that's like the best tactic actually. If you sit behind cover. You can just spray away. Heard there used to be a lot more people here before the Rojin took it over. Guess we're a little late to the party. Show me scrap on next. All that dead metal struggler is just wandering around. Now that's a place to worship, huh? Didn't I? Okay, weird. I literally thought that was the last one. I was gonna end the scrap on this so somewhere else though. Pretty sure. Uh, race truck. Deliver the bug. Am I in the wrong zone? Like... Am I blind or what? Nah, the, the, the objectives in this game are so bugged. Deliver a bug and shows me one and a half kilometers to the left. I can't even go there with my camera. Ah, oh, that's annoying. And it probably doesn't even yeah, it probably doesn't even point me to the right place. Like, yeah, I have no idea where it sends me. Somewhere down, but... Go to Onyx. So this is here. Node. Bacteria. Liberation operation. Yeah, that's where I can't even go yet. I think. Just deliver the bug to the... Wait, is this here? No, that's a gangster. Let me, let me test something though. Foreign code. One kilometer left. Bug. Yeah, see? It just shows me the wrong... It just shows me the wrong objective or something. It makes no sense. The guy with the bug should be somewhere in town, I'm pretty sure. Cropland camera. Okay, that's there too. The race is here. Oh yeah, this was where I couldn't even go to. I mean, okay, let's just go where it leads me. Not even oh god the lag what the hell I didn't even kill one guy this bad man always keep misclicking I just I just have to rebind this it's gonna remove all my energy but This has to be the shield. This has to be the, the rockets and E has to be the shield. Because I always click E first and that's the shield. Or that w wasn't the shield. Oh shit. Well, there goes my money I spent on the other chest. This one is just better. God damn.
this build is really good. The shield plus machine gun. And I just have to get used to hiding behind the cover. Oh shit. What the fuck? I mean, this this is definitely bugged and it's sending me somewhere I should not be going. Through. There's like level 20s guys here. And also like you completely can't see shit because of the camera and then there's people with machine guns all of a sudden appearing. Like the level 21 machine gun guy, I just can't run through here. This is so fucking stupid. The 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 quest markers are just bugged. It doesn't even show me where I have to go. It sends me through this area for no reason. The node. The glut. Okay, we do have 1k finally. Oh, it shows you if the quest is there. It's gonna teleport to the node. Looking good. Looking good. Oh, let me see. Did the quest unbug? Is the side mission gonna show here now? Deliver the bug. Look, and now it shows here. Now it shows the marker. There is places where it's bugged and it's not showing you where you should be going. It is in this area where I was going, kinda. So I was probably next to it. And I teleported away and now I... Yeah, it was just showing me... Oh man. This game has quite a bunch of bugs and problems, but... Quite a bunch of annoying bugs in this game. Like the game is so good. It's not any AAA or anything. Good cat. Another. Nobody's gonna miss that chrome-sucking scumbag. I just hope that those devs will quickly solve those problems. Like I said, some of them are really, really annoying. Like the, the, like the towns are big and all. The areas are just open for you to go anywhere. So it's so annoying when it's just so buggy. And it sends you to high level areas and you just get your ass kicked. How was I missing him so much? Oh my god, it marked the deliver to Tacoma mug again for me. Look, and it's gone. It's gone again. <laughs> That's so stupid. That's why I'm running into high level guys again. And like, let's see. It's level 14 quest, but it sends me through area when there's like level 20s with machine guns and stuff.
I don't think going for this quest is a smart thing, but... We'll literally just have to deliver the bug. usually enter the area not seeing what I'm approaching to it's just a group of guys shredding with crazy guns Did we actually reach it? I guess from the other side, so we don't have to fight the machine gun guy. Yeah, that sh shield I'm using is a must-have, man. Have to play with that shield. Okay. Oh, they focus on the turret, actually. Leveled up, nice. I mean, at least they are focusing on the turret for a second. Didn't do anything, though. Hello? Is it down there? Did he... Run away because I was shooting? Uh, like, do I leave it on his bike? I can't. Oh man. Like, those things definitely test my patience for sure. I'm a patient person. Like at this point, I don't, I don't know what happened. Did, did I like shoot the NPC? I have to come back here eventually. I ran all this way, fought all of those guys to not be able to finish the quest. Nice. I mean, uh, I don't think running away does anything. I should just drop it off at Torkas at Dreamworld and call it a cycle. At the Dreamworld. I'm in Corp Zone. What is Dreamworld? There is... Oh, shit. There we go. Please be it. I can go down. Oh, God. Are there gonna be high-level enemies here? Seem like it's what I should be doing. Just sends me back up. The 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 markers for the quests are completely trash in this game. The quests just bug out all the time, sending you somewhere where you should not be going, or they just don't show up at all. That's a really annoying part with how open this world is. Like, what is this? I, and I, at this point I have no idea if I should go down there if you can even reach that place I read the description of the quest too I should be going to like Dreamworld it says maybe here 
doesn't look like I can go down there. Oh, he sends me back. Oh, uh, they have hackers? Did I see it right? Yeah, this guy looks like a hacker. What do I do if he... Oh, oh. You hack his robot. Okay, I see. That's cool. I like that. I thought... I couldn't... For some reason shoot his robot. What does it do? Explode on them? Fights for me? I don't know. That is cool that the hacking is like a part of combat there. It's pretty annoying that they can't die though. I don't know man, this is really stupid, just running into the places I should not be running because the quest is bugged. Let's go main mission. I'm like, I really want to just go all out on this game, all side missions, but... The more side missions I try to do, the more annoyed I get, I just should keep going for the main ones. And if we finish the game and there's still time before other games come out. Then I guess I could go for the side stuff. So much time wasted just trying to do a side mission. That you can't even finish. We're just gonna be... I mean, I keep saying this, but you know, when it comes to like RPGs with open world and stuff, I always try to do side missions. It's annoying if it's bugging out and you lose so much time. I was like struggling going through high level enemies to reach this place and it ends up being all pointless. My scan has revealed an alternate entry option into the Onyx Void facility. No organics nearby. Oh, is it gonna be? Oh no, this way. Maybe this will actually lead us to the rest. The quest too. to get a playlist going with music from this game hopefully it's all made for the game <laughs> what is this oh room sweeper is this the smg from before is this a new weapon oh i think this is the smg from before It is ballistic submachine gun. Too bad. But that's the person that talked to the guy in the beginning of the game. 
done with the previous agreement. Can it be arranged? Anything can be arranged, but I doubt you have Eucreds enough to cover a premium fee. We have access to certain emergency funds. Then give me proof of these funds, and I'll make some inquiries. I promise you'll have it before the end of the next cycle. We need those isotopes. I said proof, not promises. We're done here. <sighs> Very well. It's weird they not allowing me to have my weapons out. We are in like a hostile territory. We should not be in here. That's the place where I have to go with my side quest. You're kidding me, man. Is it gonna be now unlocked? I had to leave the bug for the guy at Dream World. That's really shitty. If this thing was locked and I went all the way there, and now the main mission is sending me there. Yeah, definitely it's kind of like weird. They give you choice where to go and like what to do, but then you're locked out and you don't even know it. So sometimes you do something and it's pointless. You lose so much time because the game is at the very end not allow you to do something. You're going to be all going all the way, but at the end you're going to get stopped. So see, like, now it sends me to the same spot where the previous mission sent me. <laughs> the Dreamworld thing. 